so hello friends welcome back to the channel this is your channel where you get all the information about internship programs and training programs so today we are discussing about s a a r c internship program that is south asian association for regional cooperation and it is organized by secretariat in kathmandu nepal so it is a joint collaboration of six countries seven six to eight countries and here the uh, members or the internees are uh, allowed to join this program in regards to the internship or in regards to the regional center of Kathmandu Nepal the summer internship is going to take place between summer and winter so in summer season it will be between may to july and in winter season it will be from november to january so uh, there are many students and researchers who are willing to take this kind of internship program this is internship program it is internationally renowned program and will take place in nepal and you have to be present there you have to present your report and you have to present your oral presentation in order to get your certificates or in order to get satisfied from the saarc internship program so here is the online website online page uh, and in this page you will be getting all the information about the exchange program or the internship program that is from saarc internship so uh, in 2024 there were 33 students who were involved and enrolled in kathmandu nepal and completed their internship and were awarded certificates so this time also in the year 2025 there Uh, the the application is open to all the students and we will let you know what are the major guidelines and what are the guidelines uh, criteria and eligibility criteria for the students who are willing to take part uh, admission in these kind of research work or project oriented or uh these kind of uh, uh, projects like uh, training programs in international and as well as national level so uh you just have to click on the guidelines for saarc internship program uh there uh, one of the portal will open up and then you will be uh mentoring or watching guidelines of saarc internship program so in this internship program it is uh widely accepted in the south asia region through uh research and academia and at professional level this sip internship program will allow all the internees you have to go through the uh, report writing and video making and oral presentations and you have to present these kind of uh, formality or these kind of courses or disciplines that you have been taught in the internship in front of secretary journal sarc kathmandu and you have to document all the your work research work that you have been doing in this research internship the accommodation uh, and maintenance of the internees will be their responsibility the secretariat will not be responsible for any kind of accommodation food and transport and the secretariat will not cover the cost of your travel so you have to manage all the accommodation and manage all the preparations do your preparation well for this internship and obtain your visa from uh, india to nepal or if you are in any other country obtain your visa to nepal and then you have to write down all the formalities and you have to uh, do the internship in the month of uh, summer that is may to july and maybe in the winter that is uh, january to uh, december to january or whatsoever it is so eligibility those uh, sarc internship allow students who are undergraduates graduates and post graduates from south asia region the sip is open to all the researchers of any nationality or any university that is recognized a well known recognized university one of the application form you have to seek from the website fill it down and then you have to apply and mail it to the email address or home page of the secretariat the students 
who are uh, parental for the internees for the students a uh, parental consent from needs to be filled means you have to take consent from your parents wherever it is needed certificate will be awarded at the end of the program at the time of application the trainee should have to submit the statement of about 500 words that is your sop or motivation whatever you like so you have to write it down in 500 words while filling up the application and then at the end of the placement program you have to make oral presentation of about 30 minutes during at the function of secretariat and carry them all during your uh, placement at the secretariat and then one certificate will be given to you from the secretariat of Nepal Kathmandu. These all the things have been mentioned on the website. You can go through the website. You can check the website. We will uh, insert the website link to the description box. We have a description box mainly for the uh, Google form links and all the application form links. So you don't have to worry about it. So this is all about the SAARC Secretary Journal Oversee Implementation Internship Program. If you have any doubts, you can uh, drop a message on our comment section or you can directly email us and contact us. Secondly, we are uh, discussing about SAARC internship program application form. So just you have to click on the link. Uh, one of the portal will open up and it is in the uh, this Google doc file. So you have to download it, fill it and then send it to the secretariat. So this is SAARC internship program application form. You have to present all the personal data here, then your educational performance or employment performance. If you are employed and if you have a master degree, if you are a researcher, you are eligible to apply. Just mention all the details carefully in this uh, sections. And then if you have any scholarships or awards received career plans further the sop what are the uh, your motivation to join this internship and the main thing is that these are the assigned discipline area so we will discuss one by one first off internship will be in human resource development agriculture and rural development Environment, natural disaster, economic trade, social affairs, information, energy, and education. So these are the internship information that you are uh, dealing with and that you will present internship or you will be uh, doing research for. Lastly, there will be a declaration by the candidates and all the uh, formalities and appropriate details should be mentioned in the form and then you have to. Uh, send the form to the secretariat so there will be uh, chances of you getting internship more fill out these instructions properly and a 500 words motivation letter properly so you don't have to worry about the participation or you ha don't have to worry about whatever the results are but firstly you should apply to the internship so thank you very much if you find this channel helpful and you find this video very helpful so give us uh, feedback on the comment section like our videos and have a good day thank you